What is the French paradox? This is the idea that the French people have far less heart disease than Americans do, even though they eat a high-fat diet. So scientists and doctors are trying to explain this away primarily by the French wine consumption, because wine apparently has things in it that are good for heart health. Now, I don't think it's that simple, and I think it's more related to the fact that the French do eat a high-fat diet, but it's also low in carbohydrates, also low in white table sugar, although there's no difference really between white table sugar and carbohydrates such as grains, fruits, and vegetables. They all break down into blood glucose, which forms glycated proteins, which are part of your blood vessels, and they wreak havoc with your blood vessels, even creating holes, and the cholesterol comes in actually to heal you. That's where the cholesterol came from in the blood vessels. So we got that all wrong. So the French paradox says that because they drink wine, they can survive the high-fat diet. Of course, what they don't know is that this high-fat diet is consumed along with less carbohydrate and there's more physical activity in France than there is here. So this is the French paradox, and I don't think it's as simplistic as our experts would make it out to be, but that's the model, and you want to do what the French do eat more saturated animal fat, and consume less carbohydrate, because carbohydrate is the real scourge.